As week seven of winter quarter approaches, midterms and projects are coming up quickly for Northwestern students. At Norris Student Center, students can be found working away, hunched over textbooks and computers for hours on end. On Thursday, Norris offered a unique opportunity for students to take a break from all of their hard work and the stress that comes with midterms. Instead of having to pay the usual $3 for skate rentals, Norris offered free rentals to students. They also provided some snacks and hot beverages that were quickly devoured by the famished students. The event was sponsored by Wild Chat, which is a phone peer listening service for students that promotes mental wellness. They were hoping to promote mental wellness with this event by giving students an opportunity for stress relief. However, most people actually came for other reasons besides needing to relieve stress. The rink closed for the season on Sunday, and students had their own sentimental reasons to come out for one last skate. I decided to come out because I heard it was the last week, the last week um, which they would be doing it, and I guess I've come out a lot over the past like couple of years, so I guess I was a little nostalgic as a senior that I wanted to come out like one last time. Well, I heard that this is like the last weekend for like ice skating at Norris, and I really like ice skating. I used to be a competitive figure skater, so I just really like ice skating, especially because it's free here at Norris, so... I thought it'd be like a good last time to do this. I have never um, ice skated on the Norris rink until today. And it was free and Andy, was, my friend was free, so I was like, let's go do it. It'll be a lot of fun. I, my neighbors used to have an ice rink in um, their backyard, so I would skate a lot over the winter. And I haven't done it in a long time. No matter what people's reasons were for skating, the event definitely achieved its goal. There were no signs of stress on the rink. For 2012, this is Sarah Philby reporting.